video, we will continue to learn about the slicer settings within Expert Mode of Flash Print. Specifically, we will look at the Raft section. Our first option lets us enable or disable the use of a raft for our prints. Rafts are useful to increase adhesion or to provide a more level print surface if our print bed is slightly warped. For printers with two extruders, like the Inventor or Creator series, the Select Extruder option appears. This can be useful when using support specific filaments. Margin is the offset of the raft from the outline of the first layer of the model. Space to model along the z-axis is the vertical space between the top layer of the raft and the base layer of the model. Adjusting this setting can assist with adhesion to the raft or improve ease of removal after printing. It will also change the finished quality of our model's base layer. Above raft extrusion ratio applies to the first layer of our model. A higher extrusion ratio will provide a better first layer. However, it will be more difficult to remove from the raft. Above raft maximum speed is the print speed for the first layer of our model. The options here allow us to adjust the settings for our bottom layer. Starting with height, a thicker layer will provide better heat insulation as well as providing greater benefit for warped build plates. A wider path width will help with printing the first layer but will require slower print speeds. Increasing the fill density will provide a more stable raft, however it will also increase the print time. And print speed lets us ensure that we are laying our first layer down at the right pace alongside our other settings. The options for top and middle layers are almost exactly the same as our bottom layer options with the addition of a layers selection for both top and middle layers. This option lets us choose how many layers our middle and top sections of our raft will have. You can also adjust the fill density for the middle layers. The top layers gets the option to adjust the angle between model instead of fill density. This is the print direction of the top layer compared to the print direction of the base layer of the model. In its current setting, the top layer will be printed with a 90 degree difference.